up for us from yesterday. You know, all these students are back in their high schools. They're working in their own ensembles where they are working on music for an entire year or, may, or at least maybe half a year to prepare for a spring concert or something. So they actually spend a lot longer time to, to get things to come to fruition. In this setting, it's just a few days, but it's a really intensive kind of setting where they're, they're working, they, we're probably putting in as much time in these four days as they might put in in, in four weeks at home. And because they're all sort of the selected, sort of the honors kids, the whole level of musicianship is a, is a notch or two higher than what they have collectively at their own schools. And so I think they feed off that and they know they want to you know, rise to the challenge. <laughs> Some of these kids are, when they're on their own, they're like, yeah, I want to go check out some Miles Davis, or I want to listen to Keith Jarrett, and, and you know, and, but I'm sure there's a lot of them that when they're at home, they just want to listen to, to you know, whatever the pop thing of the day is. And with it, for these few days, they collectively put their energy together. Um, we, we'd like to think that they will leave here and be as interested in listening to you know, the Count Basie Orchestra as they are in listening to Beyonce, but you know, who knows? Let's talk about words, a letter and a letter on a string. We'll hold 